pictures. I just finished the uh, press portion right here. Uh, with the, it's got the wheel on it. Uh, this was a ton. This was really tricky. It was hard to do this. It was hard to rip everything down. And all the joints are all mortised and tenoned. And it turned out great. I'm really happy with it. So I'll, uh, let me bring the camera in. I'll give you a little bit closer view. Here you can see the top of it where the, this cast arch. Of course, you turn the wheel. This is made to put a 2x4 in there. So it takes two, two, one person on each side. And you just take turns turning that around to crush the apples. But this uh, is all, it's recessed in here for strength. And then there's two big heavy bolts through here. The bolts are kind of cool. They're the, the, the original ones, the square heads. You just don't see those very often. And I, I haven't sanded this, or it's not finished. It's just, um, I just uh, got done putting it together. These joints here, they're all lead in here. They're all uh, mortise and tenon. So that will be super strong, both sides. And then this is the original hardware. You can see the piece of uh, threaded rod that goes through and ties that all together. But overall, it turned out really good. I'm, I like it. I, I was going to go a little bit more decorative. They've got... The original one had the the fluting done here, or the chamfer, chamfer maybe you call that done. But I kind of like the little more contemporary of the square look. It looks more uh, timber frame style. This is definitely timber framing, but on a smaller scale. But I just wanted to quickly share this with you. It did turn out good. I really, uh, really like it. You know, joints are always never as good as they, I'd like them to be, but you just, sometimes you got to stop torturing yourself and just deal with it. Papa. So this is the rest of the frame. So this piece right here, of course, is one of these. So the whole front section is done. All we have to do is the rear, and we're ready. So thanks for watching. We'll see you next time around. It just doesn't get any more dangerous than that. <laughs>